welcome the lovely Eva Longoria Parker, everybody. a blue card to talk to a woman that looks like you. I can tell you that. You are lovely. How are thank you? you? Welcome You're to handsome the show. too. Really? Thank yeah. you. I love you to say that again I later. <laughs> he not speak so much good English right now. Don't know why. Don't know why. Did you change your hair? Uh, it's no. It's spikier. Is it really? Yeah. Well, you've never seen me before. Yes, I have. I watched the show. Oh, oh gosh, I forget. Yeah. Sometimes people do that. Yeah. You know, it's, I, no, do you ever re really forget that? Do you think when people come up and say things about Desperate yeah. Housewife, do you ever forget? I do forget, like, if I'm in a, I'm in a grocery market or something and people mm -hmm. are staring at me and I go, what? Yeah. <laughs> and they're like, I love your show. And I'm like, oh, my God, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. I know. It's like, what, what is it? Oh, yeah. yeah. I'm on TV. I forget. Yeah. Yeah, I do forget. No, because no, I, I don't like to but be stared at. But people were staring at you before you were on TV. Come on. No. Oh, come on. No. Creepy guys in the supermarket? You <laughs> you. Yeah, that's right. Isn't it? <laughs> that's, see, my hair was different then, but now yeah. you remember. Yeah. You. Did you used to work here? Right in I the did. The next studio over, Young and the Restless. Oh, gosh. I that's I, I, lo I loves me my uh, daytime dramas. You, can't... <laughs> you don't even know what they are. I know, I don't. <laughs> Who did you play in the Young and the Restless? Isabella. Isabella. Oh, yeah, that's yeah. right. She was good or bad? Bad. Oh, bad. Bad. Yeah, you would play a bad girl, wouldn't you? Yeah. I always play the bad girls. It's because yeah. I'm a brunette. Are brunettes evil? Yeah, they always usually cast like dark hair, bad guy, blonde hair, good girl. See, see I'm going from bad to good. Yeah. <laughs> you are. <laughs> no, no, oh dear. <laughs> Do you think I should dye it? No, I no. love salt and pepper. Really? Like George Clooney, that salt and pepper. Clooney's gorgeous, isn't he? Oh, <laughs> He is. I know. He is. So, you, why long were you on the soap opera? Here? I was on, on Young Nurses for three years, and then I got fired. No, really? What for? Just the storyline ended. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. What happened? No. <laughs> no, they let me out of, they were like, eh, the storyline ended. Really? It wasn't a thing with Bob Barker or something like no. that? No. No. Did you ever see Bob walking around? You know, oh. Yeah. Yeah, I did. I did, and I used to always want to spin the, the wheel, you know. He would have let you. <laughs> You know, it's so funny because I, I, is he, he, we used to use his dressing room sometimes when there was an overflow of actors on certain days, and he had a weird dressing room. I know. Yeah. Well, he has to have soil from his native land and the coffin and all that stuff. <laughs> it was He's fun, like, though. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, but Drew Carey's doing it now. Do you know Drew? I don't know Drew. He's lovely. Yeah, yeah. He's cheery. He's cheery. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. He plays, he plays, he watches soccer all the time. That's not you. You're basketball. Yeah. Man, aren't you? yeah. Yeah. Football, you say. Oh, yeah. You yeah. call it football, don't football, you? Football, yeah. I do yeah. call it football. I don't anymore. I'm an American now. I have to call do it you, soccer. Um, you know Thierry Henry? No. He plays soccer. He was in our wedding. He's like the number one soccer player two years ago. Well, what, in America? In the world? No. In the, really? he, plays, he played for Arsenal. Now he plays for Barcelona. Well, I, I can't keep up. Who's your team then? It's the San Diego Chargers. Oh. <laughs> I do have a soccer team, but nobody's heard of them. Why? Are they Scottish? Because they're very, very bad and oh, wait, Scottish. Are you Irish or Scottish? Scottish. So Scottish. Is it, is it it's much the same thing. It is, isn't it? It really is, actually, yeah. yeah it's you all sound the same. We do kind of sound the same, and my, my father's family were Irish. Uh, so where are you? You're from Texas, right? I'm Mexican descent, though. Oh, right. Yeah. Okay. So do you say you're Mexican or Texican? I say Texican. <laughs> Texican. I'm now I'm a Frenchican. Frenchican? Our kids will be Frenchicans. Frenchican's quite nice, isn't it? Yeah. Are you living in Texas? Is I that live where you in guys Texas. live? We live in San Antonio. Oh, and, nice. Uh, and then I just fly back and forth. I hear they have a very good tattoo parlor in San Antonio. I, I've never gotten a tattoo in San Antonio. Have you gotten a tattoo anywhere? Everywhere. Really? <laughs> Where, where are they? They're strategically hidden. They have to be. I mean, my God, there's not much okay, you can't... That's, oh, my, right, yeah. that's my wedding day. Oh, that's that's lovely. Yes, that's Pisces. Oh, yeah. yeah, yeah. And that's a star from Le Petit Prince, the little book. Oh, nice. And, um, wait, that's my wedding day. Where are you? Yeah, right, that, that, that's the wedding day. It's in Roman numerals. That's like the Super Bowl. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> 
soon, no man. And Tony has this, has our wedding date tattooed on his ring finger, because he never gets to play, put, uh, put his ring on. Well, yeah, he couldn't. Yeah, yeah. So, it's well, that's good, though. That's good that you got a tattoo on it, because you can't go, oh, 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 oh. He's like, right. oh, oh, there it is. Like, bam. You're it's very there. clever. I'm clever. Now, Texas. Uh, I, I, I like Texas. I've always had a good time in Texas. Really? Yeah, yeah. Where'd you go? Well, I've been to Fort Worth. I've been to Houston. Uh -huh. And I've been to, uh, what's the state capital there? Austin. Austin. That's you, great. They have the Austin, Texas is one of the wildest towns I've ever been It is. Been it's in. like all the hippies from the 70s retired in Austin. I know. Yeah. But, but Texas, of all places, for Texas. hippies, you, they're like, that's Texas. just what I said. But they <laughs> Uh, well, you have to go to San Antonio because that's the best place. Really? What's yeah. so great about and San Antonio? And I'm from Antonio? Corpus Christi, right. which is the beach. So, yeah, the beach. What's beach life like in Texas? Is well, it it's, like it's like not blue water. It's more like brown water. <laughs> it's the Gulf. All right. <laughs> I don't it's play the Gulf. golf. But, no, it's really nice. <laughs> it's really nice. I love Texas. And then San Antonio is the best Mexican food. Really? Ever. Do you like Mexican food? It's Tex-Mex. Do, do you make I'm, I cook Mexican food all the time. Can you really cook? Yeah. God, I so hate your husband right now. Yeah. I cook all the time for him. Really? I just opened a Mexican restaurant here in L.A. Really? Yes. But you opened it just like a celebrity appearance, or you actually no, own no, no. it? No, no, no. My recipes uh, with Todd English. Todd English is a chef, and we got together. Wow. It's called Beso, and it's a lot of my recipes, and, and I cook all the time, so I thought I really want to do a restaurant. Yeah. that would be. When can I go? Uh, come on now. Okay. We have to go. <laughs> <laughs> but... You are adorable. Eva Longoria Parker, everybody. We'll be right back. My first guest tonight is, uh, she's on the Desperate Housewife show. She's the host of the Alma Awards, which is our Friday, September the 12th on ABC. But it's good. <laughs> Please welcome the very beautiful Eva Longoria Parker, everybody. <laughs> See you again. You're just look at you, just heavenly. <laughs> Thank you. You're just a very beautiful girl. Well, I was just helicoptered in. Really? Yes. Did you arrive by helicopter? I did. Do you go everywhere by helicopter? I do. I, do. I don't like traffic. Um, really? <laughs> we were talking about that on Monday night on were this you? show. Yeah, yeah. No. <laughs> I'm gonna take those off. No, really? I guess I had you guys. I wasn't gonna make it in time, so you guys arranged it, and it was fun. We saw Denzel's house. Denzel Washington. I know who Denzel is. And like, oh, Denzel McCafferty? <laughs> How many Denzels are there? And we saw Mark, Mark Wahlberg's house. Oh, and, right. uh, yeah, they were. You know, you can, it's illegal to take helicopters and buzz around <laughs> people's houses. Can you your fly? people did it. Really? I, thought, I we was were... surprised that he knew. Who? The, the helicopter he... guy. Well, he Because he was like, he in knows. that so and so's house. And I was like, Where's my house? Where is? Where is your house? It was. It was further east. Thank God. All right. God. You don't. You don't live near Denzel. No. Any of the Denzels. No. <laughs> Tell me about these. <laughs> Aren't these, those fun? They're fantastic. Okay, let's just keep them like that. They could be earrings. Um, they're just my bracelets. You know what? They look a little bit like, uh, you know, nuts or, I mean, you know, for... Bolts. Bolts. No, the bolts are the thing that goes oh. this way. Oh, well, this, is, this is a nut. And there's two of them. Yeah? <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Some, you got some very basic mechanics going on there, you know. That, in fact, this is the nuts and bolts of it right there. <laughs> Uh, These are very nice, though. Are they, are they a special designer or something? I don't know. All right. You're just, you're they just, just tell me to put them on. You're just rich, and you don't give a rat's <laughs> ass. I'm not. But that's good. No. That's I good. Know. I like your shoes, too, with your lovely These, red. Okay. These I know. These are Valentino. I just got them. Really? Yes. And Valentino's they're good, great. right? They're brand new. Look. Oh, my God. The oh, the stickers on it. Oh, awesome. <laughs> show me how much. Show me how much it was. <laughs> Is it? Oh, my God. That's bad luck. <laughs> oh, because you're Scottish. Yeah, you can't put shoes on the table. It's bad luck. But oh my, is that for one or both? <laughs> it's for both. That's Wait, good. Don't I get just pet put, that. I just put them on right now. You I, put them on? I'd have them in a safe. <laughs> <laughs> they are pretty, though. They're handmade. Yeah, that's they're, why. I mean, they better be pretty for that. <laughs> 
leave them here. They have their. Yeah, there is, there is you, you leave guests. them there. I'll be taking them to market. There is only guests. <laughs> That's good. You make yourself comfortable. Okay. <laughs> no, they're, they're very nice. Oh, God. Are you still? Do you still have that restaurant that you were doing? I do. Yeah, yeah. Really? How's it going? It just opened up. It's right down the street. You should go. I'm. I, I'm. It's I, I will. Beso. It's on Hollywood Boulevard. And, right. Uh, I go like, to Hollywood Boulevard a lot. <laughs> 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 no, we're in the good part of Hollywood. Right. right. Not that part. Right. But. <laughs> That part's a good part, too. You know. <laughs> Don't judge. <laughs> this is expensive shoes. Now, uh, what, what kind of food do you serve in your restaurant? It's international cuisine with a Latin flair. So we have, like, oh. great fish and steak, but we also have, like, guacamole and tacos. Oh, guacamole. Guacamole. Eh? guacamole. Do you make any of the stuff yourself? There are a lot, Most of them are my recipes, and I, I make table-side guacamole, like, four times a week. Really? Yeah, for How my come friends who come in. And everything? And you don't eat anything. I know. Then, people know. keep saying I'm pregnant because I've gained so much weight. Wait, I'm like a size one. <laughs> How could they say that you are you pregnant? I'm not. Oh, okay. No. No, but I mean you, you don't look pregnant, but I just thought you the know. People, maybe, I mean yeah. the tabloids and stuff, they keep saying, you know. Well, you know it's it. true if it's in the tabloids. I that's know. for sure. That's true. I know. <laughs> do you do you read them about because you're in them? No, well. no. We don't even I don't even you know, they're they're at the supermarket and I'm always at the supermarket and getting your guacamole ingredients. Get my guacamole get my avocados. No, who's the chef that that, that you worked with now? Todd was, English. Yeah, he's very famous, isn't he? Yeah, 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 yeah he's yeah. great. Really, chefs I always find are a bit uh, highly strung. Right, they yeah. have. Uh, I mean, not not Todd, but I, I've heard. Oh that. come on, Todd! No, too. no, not oh, Todd. Oh come on, he's a jerk. Admit it. No, I think that a lot of. Uh, I guess a lot of chefs have a lot of egos. I guess right. I, apparently in that world, like that Iron Chef world. I guess. Oh yeah, but no, it's 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 wild. They're when like Wolfgang Puck when he comes on here, he bosses me around. <laughs> Although admittedly, he is Austrian, so that he kind of comes yeah, with the Yeah. yeah. Everybody pushes the Scots around. They do a little bit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. They do. <laughs> You're do becoming you... a citizen. I'm a citizen now. Oh, you are? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you going I to took vote? The test. I am going to vote. For who? I'm not telling you. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I was at the Democratic National Convention and it was so Who are you going fun. to vote for? The Democrat. Uh huh. Okay. Yes. Well, that's, did you have a nice time? I did. It was. Uh, it was definitely historic and interesting. Yes. I tell you though, Denver worries me because I can't get enough oxygen when I'm there. Really? It's very high up. Yeah. Everybody said you're going to get a headache. You're going to get a headache. Yeah. No. I when I'm there, I'm like the plane that takes off. You've now reached cruising altitude, and we're here. And that's <laughs> it. You're in Denver. <laughs> It's very, it's very high up. I was okay with it, actually. Really? Yeah, I was in a... Are you related in any way to Sherpas, the famous mountain people of Nepal? <laughs> no. <laughs> no. You're so adorable, aren't you? I'd forgotten. <laughs> you forgot, but I cut my hair since you last You have cut night. your hair. It's very nice. Do you like it? What, yeah, no, it's very nice. I feel amazing. What's the style of that? It's called short. It's very nice. No, did you get a cup for the Alma Awards? No, the Alma Awards, um, I wear like 10 different hair pieces and wigs and, and all that fun stuff. I change like 12 times on the Alma Awards because it's, uh, we try to uh, celebrate Latino designers. Ah, right. Yeah, it's like gay NASCAR because it's like, <laughs> it's like we're off with the dress and the earrings. Whoa, 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 whoa. You had me a gay NASCAR. <laughs> I'm there. Where do I sign? <laughs> That's fantastic. I, I know, it's so much fun. We, what is the Alma Awards? The Alma Awards are the American Latino Media Art Awards. Right, so okay. Alma stands for soul, also in Spanish. And so right. we recognize positive portrayals of Latinos in music and television and film and fashion. And is it like the People's Choice Awards? Do people know what they're going to get before they... Well, no. not that that actually happens in the no. People's Choice Awards. No. I got a people... I People's Choice Award, and that was great. Uh, yeah. Oh, let me ask you a question then, if you got a People's Choice Award. I did. Did you know before you went <laughs> if you were going to get one, or did you just go hoping you would get I... one, noticing there was no one else in your category there? <laughs> I don't even know who was in my category. Well, um, yeah. But I did have to present as well, so I had uh, to go anyway. I have to present at the Emmys this year. Do you? Yeah. It's How the only, fun. It, it's the only way I get to go. <laughs> It's easy. No, no, no. No, no the Emmys are I was ticket. talking about a nomination, but I take your point. Yeah, okay. I, I, I'm never nominated either. No, no, no. You know what Jerry Seinfeld called the Emmys? Rejection for the successful, he yes. said. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Because yeah. I've never gotten nominated. No, well, you should, because you're adorable. And the Emmy for adorable goes too. Me. Yeah. <laughs> tell you because I'm going to New York for Fashion Week. This oh, fashion I love Fashion Week. Do you watch the uh, Project Runway? I don't, but Heidi Klum, I know Heidi. and um, That's I'm a great show. Yeah. It, it's, it's a great show. I love it, that show. It's so, I just met Sweet Pea the other day. Really? Do you know who that is? Yes, yeah, Sweet Pea was on last season. She was a girl okay. with the tattoos and yes, stuff like that. Yeah, no, but Christian won. 
last year. Oh, Christian, okay. uh, what was Christian's second name? He was on the show. He's very nice. I know, but man. I sew. I sew myself. I sew a lot of my own dresses, and I sew a lot. You sew. You I, like, make guacamole. Sign, I know. Yeah. I'm totally a '50s housewife. Like I love to sew and cook and clean. That's my. That's my passion. <laughs> I, I'm, I I find myself unable to go. Yeah, but <laughs> you know, for legal reasons. But yeah. That's great. Are you very traditional yeah. at home, you and Tony? Yeah. yeah, we're really traditional. Oh, good. Very, very traditional. We just celebrated one year. Congratulations. Yeah. Congratulations. Please accept, please accept these bracelets from me <laughs> as a present from all of your friends at CBS. Thank you, darling. All right, Eva, thank you so much for coming. Wait, I want to talk about something else. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Leave another guest tonight? Forget it. That's all right. Well, well, okay. Well, if they're coming, forget it. They'll no, have to go. They're gonna have to wait. All right. Well, no, we'll I'm gonna be uh, in New York for, for Fashion, Fashion Week. week yes. For um, Eminem's uh, is having this event in Fashion Week. Eminem the rapper? No, Eminem the candy. The can Even sweeter. Even sweeter. <laughs> no, Eminem. They have this premium brand coming out, and so right. it's like for adults. They, it doesn't have the the hard shell, and it comes. Sexy Eminem. It's so sexy. Really? And so they're doing this whole fashion show and uh, with candy. With candy. <laughs> Ladies and candy in one event? Yeah. I think I'm available. <laughs> you have to come. I will. <laughs> yeah, all right. And now you want to talk about? Um, I, let's see. What do you want to talk about? Oh, well, you know, I, I feel like, you know, I get enough time on the show. <laughs> to, I'll I tell you what, my eyes twitching a little bit, I noticed. Why? Today. Are you know lying? That. that means you're lying. Well, I haven't even said anything, though. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, sometimes it twitches when I'm on my, I'm lying to myself on my own. I <laughs> know, it just means you're lying. What does it mean when you're stroking the chair like that? What does that mean? Nothing, it means the chair feels good. Yeah, well, you can take it with you if you want. <laughs> it's probably about the same price as half of one of those shoes. <laughs> the lovely Eva Longoria Parker, everybody. We're very nice. You say ooh la la. <laughs> I hope you can because these young ladies, please introduce yourself to the American audience. Uh, what's your name? Marine. Marine? Marine. Yeah, yeah, all right. <laughs> uh, ma Marine? Yeah, something like that. Okay, and uh, what's your name, young lady? Marine. Also. <laughs> I see, and uh, where are you from, ladies? France. France, you say? And you also from France? Yeah. <laughs> Am I pissing you off? Not at all. All right. So, uh, do you know each other, or is it just a coincidence you're both called Bahrain and you're from France? How we met here. You met here? Yeah. Really? Yeah. Are you aware that you were sitting in lesbian room? <laughs> Je comprends. So, um, well, Marine and Marine. <laughs> Very recently, this show received a letter from France, which contained a white powder in it. <laughs> in the letter, the person that sent the white powder, the fake anthrax, I'm glad to say, <laughs> expressed an opinion about my work on television. <laughs> it wasn't that complimentary. Can you can understand? <laughs> I see. So, uh, what, are you, what are you doing in L.A. then, ladies? Um, I'm visiting. You're visiting? Yeah. And you are visiting also? Mm, no. No, you... You're here for singing. You're here for singing? Singer-songwriter. Oh, you're a singer-songwriter? Yeah. Really? Really? Hey, look, the high-pitched nature of my voice is just part of my thing, all right? <laughs> Don't leave the... Ooh -la -la. ...branch, they come... <laughs> nah. But, no, quietly, this is not the way forward, internationally. Are you, are, are you any good? Do, do you want to be on the show? 
Did you bring yeah. a guitar with you? No, I didn't. Oh, is, is it a guitar you play? Yeah. Oh, see, that's going to get in the way then. <laughs> you should be on the show. Do you have a visa? Yeah. I don't. May I borrow it? <laughs> you have a visa to perform? No. Then we should have mine on the show. <laughs> what? We can get, we can get. We'll get you on the show and you can sing. Yeah. yeah, will you sing one of your own songs? That would be cheaper for us. <laughs> yeah. 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 No, we'll, we'll do it then. This will be great. This will be, and people will go, this was when she first started. Mark Fink started on that very show. <laughs> this is great. Uh, do you not sing at all? You just visit people who sing? Yeah, uh, I dance. You dance? <laughs> I need to go and watch a couple of commercials. Daddy's busy. <laughs> <laughs>